Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vital Vinyl Vlog. Today, I have to thank my buddy Dan. We're going to be going over one of his projects today. This is Grotesque Mass with a demo compilation called Ruinous Gallows. Now, Dan is in Intestinal Hex. He is also in Fumes. So, you've heard his work before if you follow this channel. I've been meaning to go over this bad boy. Because it fucking rules. My buddy Dan, he, there he, he's got the pretty little flower shirt on. Fuck yeah, brother. Barbaric Brutality put this compilation out. And uh, you have the inexorable Barbarity demo that has Daniel on all instruments, drum programming and mixing with Jay on vocals and lyrics, Brian Rumsey on mastering, vocal recording, and engineering. And then on the Ruinous Gallows demo, we have Daniel on all instruments and drum programming with Kyle Allop on uh, vocals and lyrics and uh, dystonic sounds on the mixing and mastering side of things. Like, the lyrics are fucking great. This is some killer fucking death grind. Like, I really love the drum programming. It's it's just dialed. I love good drum programming. It's just I'm weird. About it. something that legit whoa I didn't even notice that that noose I'm an idiot <laughs> sick cosmetics fucking awesome tunes like I had a demo I was going to review and I couldn't I couldn't do it like it was I, I was uh, all right Pretty much, there's this band. I randomly got their demo. And I tried listening to it last night. And I tried listening to it again. And I was just going to make a cautionary tale video about how important production is. Now, this just completely destroys. Like, for real. If you can get your hands on this, and you're a fan of, like, Willow tip 
death grind. Because that's what this reminds me of. Like, bands like Pretty Little Flower. Like, as soon as I saw that t-shirt, I was like, oh, fuck. And then when I listened to it, I was like, yo, like, you know, it sounds like Watchtower at fucking points. Like, Watchmaker, I mean, not Watchtower. Like, it, like, Kill Fucking Everyone by Watchmaker. It's like one of the most just ridiculous, over-the-top albums ever. But, like, this really reminded me of Death Grind in, like, 2004. And in a good way. Like, it was just a good time for, like, bands of this nature that were mixing death metal and grind. And, you know, you had, like, bands like Lang Chi, uh... I'm trying to, I, I'm drawing a blank on, like, Rotten Sound had their own Finnish vibe, especially with Exit, Exit, such a gnarly fucking record that nobody talks about from Rotten Sound, but, uh, again, this just brought me back to, like, you know, because I would blind by from Willow Tip sometimes, and uh, you'd end up with some sick shit, like, be like, oh, like, that's fucking, like, it, you know, you'd be looking cause back in the day, like, I would go see a band and, you know, sometimes you would just look at, like, somebody in the band's t-shirt and then go home and check the band out and next thing you know, you're buying their whole entire discography because they're fucking ridiculous. Like, this shit happens all the time. Like, I, I remember I had no idea who Pig's Blood was. I went to a show to see No Funeral and Pig's Blood played and it was just like, what the fuck? This is awesome. And it was all just because we went to go see a completely different band. Stuff like that, you know, that's how you used to find out about new bands. If you weren't, pay, if you, weren't you know, on AIM or doing snail mail or any of that shit. That's how you found out about new tunes. Mostly was looking at people's t-shirts and shit like that. Looking in magazines, but... I really like the Ruinous Gallows demo. I really like the Inexorable Barbarity demo. They're right to the fucking point. Like, it's great. If you like Death Grind, can't really go wrong here with the uh, Grotesque Mass. Like, Barbaric Brutality did a great job with the cassette. Especially the cassette cosmetics. It sounds great, and it adds on to Dan's fucking discography of awesome. Because everything that he has his name on pretty much is fucking fire. And I'm not just saying that because, you know, I, I really, you know, he's one of those dudes that's just a fucking great musician. He's a great songwriter. Grotesque Mass demo compilation on Barbaric Brutality. This is Ruinous Gallows and um, the Inexorable Barbarity demo together. And it's fucking great. Like, again, if you dig, you know, Death Grind that's cut with a razor's edge with programmed drums that aren't over the top or anything, they're very well mixed and everything. Fuck yeah. Now, here is what happens when you do a demo and production is not the number one priority. The priority here seems to be the artwork. Now I'm going I'm going to legit go over this band cuz to me this is a cautionary listen cuz it's really not that bad when you turn your volume down but listening at maximum volume does not yield maximum results 
it yields an unlistenable mess. First off, you have like a six minute sample. It's actually seven Mississippis of fast forwarding. I timed it. But the artwork is fantastic. Like I'm just gonna go to show you real fast. Some of the art. <laughs> But the test here, I want you, ladies and gentlemen, to listen to the drum production after I fast forward this sample. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six Mississippi, seven Mississippi. <laughs> It's legit a release that I really feel with better production, it would be not only listenable, but like, it would just be a lot better. But when it comes to Grotesque Mass, this is one of my favorite projects Dan has right now. I mean, I really do like Fumes, like, he really kills it in that band. And Intestinal Hex, like... I know people compare my band to Sivorous a lot. I also, like, I, I feel we kind of have a similar sound to Intestinal Hex also. Which, it, trust me, that is all, that's none of that shit's intentional. It just happened like that. And speaking of A Cursed Womb, Crown of Piss promo, I'm done. Vocally, I'm finished. <laughs> Excuse me, I got done yesterday. Womb of the Ibex. The Ibex. That was so hard. Seriously, that's, that song is no fucking joke. Especially the time ghoul part. But I'm beyond fucking stoked on what Dan's doing with the underground right now. With multiple projects being top shelf listens. Same goes with Grotesque Mass, Ruinous Gallows, Inexorable Barbarity, fucking A, Dan and Company. Killer shit, especially using two different vocalists on two different demos, but still managing to punch you in the face. Fuck yeah. And again, if you like, you know, your, your grind... Mixed with death metal and programmed drums, you can't go wrong with fucking Grotesque Mass on Barbaric Brutality Records. And I have to thank Dan for sending this shit my way. Pretty sure it's all long sold out. But, like, I really, like, honestly, I, I just think he's an amazing songwriter. And this is a great example of his amazing songwriting, but definitely worth your time. Both those demos, they fucking rip. And we also have this coming on cassette. Oh, yes. Barbaric Putrefaction on tape. It's gonna be re-fucking-diculous. 
But as always, thanks for watching. You fucking rule. Thank you again, Dan. Hails.